Hey guys, it's Shannon, and I am so happy to be filming this video <laughs> today. So, ta-da, UPS. Okay, um, so I have not put a haul up on this video in, it seems like, a while. And I placed a large order with scrapbook.com, which you already know from the title of the video. But I placed an order with them, gosh, like a month ago. And they shipped it out super duper fast. It was my first time ever ordering with them. I was very impressed. Came really quick and I opened the box and then I didn't pull anything out. Cause I'm like, oh, I wanna film a haul. And then I got busy and <laughs> I didn't film the haul. So this box has been sitting around for like a month. So I don't even remember everything I ordered. So this is gonna be like a surprise box for you guys and for me as well. <laughs> so let's go ahead and pull the stuff out. We have bubbles. Package. I hope there's not an invoice with my address. We're gonna find out. Let's see. Okay, here's paper. Here's other stuff. What else is in the box? Nothing. Okay, so maybe there's not an invoice or maybe Paul pulled it out for me because I'm not seeing it. Okay, let's go ahead. Whoa, sorry, just hit the camera. Let's see, let me adjust the light for you guys real quick because I feel like it might be a little dark. There, is that better? Okay, hopefully that's better. Let's go ahead and open this up. Now, I bought a lot of stuff in here for making homemade traveler's notebooks. I really enjoy making those and I thought a lot of this stuff would be really cute. A lot of the paper, especially. So let's go ahead and see everything here. Okay, let me set these off to the side. Oh, maybe my invoice is in here. It is. Okay, let me pull it aside. Don't want to show my, my address. <laughs> okay, scrapbook.com. What do we have here? The Big Shot Giveaway. Oh, you can win a giveaway. And or a big shot giveaway. Echo Park paper because the journey is worth remembering. I actually love Echo Park. They have really cool stuff. So I actually, I really like that too. I might use that map in a project. Okay, let's go ahead and look at this stuff. So I bought this washi. This, I think this is new washi from the Carpe Diem collection. It's the Just Believe. And yeah, I'm pretty sure this is a brand new collection. It has, um, I don't know, it's just very Christmassy, just like the little flowers and berries. You can kind of, that's what it looks like there. I don't know if you can see the washi here, but it's pretty cool. You get 10 yards. That's really nice. And I picked up these stickers. They are from the Old Holy Night collection by Simple Stories. I just thought these would be really fun and pretty to use this Christmas in my journals. And I journal sometimes just like in normal journals and I also journal in Traveler's Notebooks. If you're not sure what a Traveler's Notebook is, there's tons of videos on YouTube that you can look them up. They are a ton of fun. Okay, so here is our paper. Let's see. This paper's upside down. So I picked up these. These are by Photo Play and it's Shark Attack. This is Shark Bait. And I thought this would be really cute. We're gonna be going to the beach and I thought I'd make a traveler's notebook. I Since I make my own, I like using double-sided cardstock to make the covers of them. So I thought this would make a great beach theme one. This is also in Shark Attack. I I picked it for this side. I like all the little sharks and the stripe will make a really nice inside cover. And then I picked up the 12 by 12 sticker sheet as well. Very cool. And what's this? Okay, this is Echo Park, A Perfect Autumn. And this is the 12 by 12 sticker sheet. I will be honest, this is super duper cute, but I bought it for that bear right there. I just think he is so adorable. <laughs> so I picked up that. And then I think this is gonna be in the same collection. Uh, it says Vintage Blessings. So maybe it is a different collection, but these are the four by six cards that you cut apart. And I thought they were so, so cute. I love this one right here. 
And I like to cut these apart. And that side's just plain. I like to cut these apart and add them to my journal. Now, of course, if you're doing like pocket scrapbooking or, you know, Project Life, any of those things, you can use these kind of cards for that as well. Love that one. But like I said, I just cut them apart and put them in my journal. And those are always double-sided. This one is really cute. I bought this to use as a cover for a journal. So it just has all the different fall and autumn words and this cute little squirrel. And that's the other side. I thought these trucks were adorable. This is from Cartabella. This is in the Hello Fall collection. And this is kind of like a textured cardstock. It's really neat. But I thought the trucks carrying the pumpkins were adorable. And then you have a plaid. Okay, this is Cartabella as well. Haunted House. So these are just cut apart. For Halloween and I'm looking forward to Halloween. Ooh, that side's really cool too with the ghosts. I bought it for the cut aparts but the ghosts are really awesome. This one, tell me this is not adorable. So this is back to the perfect autumn and I guess I better start going faster otherwise we'll be here all day. Okay, really cool clocks. This is from Bow Bunny. And this side has like all the different little like milk caps. We have some music notes and this side with all the cars with Christmas trees and presents. Okay, now it looks like I bought one, two, three, four, five, <laughs> five of this one. So it just is like a yellow striped paper on this side but I bought it for this side. So this is by American Crafts and it's Amy Tangerine. I loved it because we travel a lot and I thought the airplanes would be perfect. So I wanted to pick up several for that. Here's some candy corn stripe with cut aparts. Pumpkin guts. <laughs> okay, here's this side and I bought it for these cut aparts. Here's another, wow, that's really pretty. It's like a dictionary background with the flowers. But I bought it, again, for these cut aparts. This is a great way to add interest to your journal. Here's some Christmas ones. With polka dots. And hopefully you can see at the top here, as I show them, what brand they're from. So these are all simple stories that I'm working on right here. Really, really cute. I have like a paper addiction, paper and washi tape. <laughs> so this is photo play. So pretty, just the different fall. I got it because I love this one, Happy Thanksgiving. I find it hard to find a lot of cute Thanksgiving things. So I was excited to see that. Okay, back to simple stories. Here's another Thanksgiving one really cute stripe this goes with the oh holy night and I love this this has gold foil on it so 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 pretty I I can't wait to use this it's gorgeous and the stars that's really pretty okay this side is like a candy cane stripe this is another one that has gold foil this is Christmas joy you see that gold foil? So pretty. This is from the Carousel Collection. I thought this was cute. You could cut those all apart. Okay, now I have a bunch of these. One, two, three of these. There are stars on that side. And this side are these really colorful cameras. This is by Chamel. It's Glitter Girl. Super cute. Here's some stripes. I bought it for this side with the rainbows. Again, Chamel. And it looks like I have two of these. This side's really cool because it has this, they're polka dots, but it's the rainbow, um, what's that called? When it, what's that called? I can't think of the word. <laughs> when it, um, it's not really like ombre, but you know what I mean. Anyway, I got the glasses. Again, this is from Chamel. This is Glitter Girl. And last but not least, it looks like, oh no, one more. I got two of these with the cameras. And this side is really cute too. With all the little rainbow cameras and bikes and all that. 
And then this page has the bicycle, but I bought it for the coffee cups. And again, Chamel. Okay, that was a lot of paper. Let's see what else we have here. I have cat fur up here from Simon. Okay, let's see what's in our little baggie. I don't have any idea. What is it? It's a surprise present. Oh, okay. So I did order this, I forgot. This is new washi tape from Paper House. And what's this one? What collection is it? I don't see. Well, it's really cool. You get two washi tapes. You get this little stripe one right here that's like a hollow foil, if you can see. And then you get these little cupcakes. How cute are they? Adorable. So I guess I only got one washi tape. I thought I ordered more, but. Okay, let's see. Let me take the rubber band off everything they sent here. There's just all kinds of stuff. Let's just get going. These are by Paper House too. These are their new little sticker flakes and I thought the sticker flakes were adorable. So these are the Halloween ones. You get 32 and they have metallic on them. This is the beach or ocean themed one. Huh, that doesn't open. The other one was open. Look at the cute little pineapple with glasses, you guys. Adorable. Looks like there's maybe a little water gun and beach ball. Okay, so here's what you get. Those, here's the Halloween one. Love the kitty. Okay, this one, super duper cute. The little donut, these are all like little kawaii donuts and coffees and cupcakes. I might need to get more of those. Those are cute. And then the fall one. Super duper cute. This right here is the main reason why I placed the order. I wanted this little stamp set for my planner and journal because it has Facebook and YouTube and Twitter and Instagram and all that kind of stuff, which I just thought was awesome. So those are gonna be perfect. Then I picked up a couple of the Simple Stories Christmas packs or uh, sticker packs. This is Very Merry and you get three sheets of stickers in there, which you can see right there. I really like the words, they're clear. So when you stick them on your journal, you know, they don't have the white outline. Then this pack of stickers is also from Very Merry. This is eight four by six sheets. These do have the white outline. But look at how many you get and I think these are like four dollars so that is a great price okay Tim Holtz what is this clippings stickers Halloween oh yeah <laughs> okay so you get four sheets in here and they are all different but they just have different like Halloween words and phrases and I think that is awesome. Now, you can use these obviously not at Halloween. For example, this one says, he gave us a terrible scare. Well, I mean, if you have kids, if you have a son, <laughs> that could be appropriate year round, right? Okay, what's this? Chamel, Glitter Girl, Cardstock, and Lenticular Shapes, 30 pieces. So look at those. I didn't realize there were lenticular ones in here. So these are little die cuts. How cute are those? I love them. And let's see, more Paper House. I had to pick up these little um, puffy clips. These are the little cupcakes that match the stickers. More Paper House. These are their little epoxy stickers. These are the Halloween ones. And so they're slightly raised. More, more, more. Um, let's see, here's more of the, no, these are not, these are different. Okay, Paper House, these are more stickers. These are like foily and metallic and they are completely flat. And it looks like you get two sheets in here, which is pretty cool. So these are all little Halloween ones. Here's another one. Let's see, do they have a collection? It doesn't have a name, but look at these little planets. How cute are those? I might need to go back and add some of these for my Eclipse page in my journal. Here are little like love or Valentine's ones with little bears, look at the little bear, the little pug dog. How cute is that? I know somebody I need to give that little pug dog to. Okay, 
These are little like summer picnic barbecue kind of theme. There's little bathing suits and grills, flip flops, ice creams. And again, all of these have two sheets. Here's more little Valentine's Day. These are like conversation hearts and they have cute little faces and mustaches. And here are the fall ones with the little hedgehogs and raccoons and owls. Super duper cute. And then I have another one of the puffy ones. This is like from the kawaii one as well with the little cupcakes and ice creams. So, so cute. And what's this? Oh yeah, I forgot about these. <laughs> this is also from Paper House. It's the um, same from the like kawaii. They are adhesive pockets, it says. So it says use two pockets to hold any size. Use a single pocket to hold small items. So you can use a pocket like that and tuck things in or you can use two and then put bigger items in. So you get 12, you get two each of those shown right there. And look at how pretty those are. I thought these would be great in my journal. So super cute. I'm glad I picked those up. Okay, we're almost at the end, guys. We have some Cartabella Hello Fall Ephemera. These are just little die cut pieces. So these are the ones you get inside. I love this truck. And then I have some Tim Holtz. This is from his new Halloween collection. This is the ephemera pack. And you can kind of see some of the pieces. There's 109 pieces in here. So I love Tim Holtz products. There's always so many die cuts and stuff. Um, and it doesn't show you what you get. But it's all different kinds of skeletons and things like that. I can show you um, if you want to see. Also, I'm going to try to link some of these products in the description box. So if there's something particular you saw that you liked or wanted more info about, I will try to link those for you. Um, what is this? Baseboards. Four pieces Halloween. Oh. Printed book board used as a project base or structure. I thought this was going to be a whole pack of, um, of die cuts that looked vintage like this. These are not die cuts. These are really th thick, um, like chipboard pieces. They're awesome. Look at that. I don't know what I'm going to do with them, though. Arsenic. <laughs> these are really, really cool, you guys. If you have any idea for these, if you've used these, please let me know because I don't... I don't know what to use them for, but they're so cool. And then that's just the backing piece, which is actually really nice because you could use that in a project. But okay, let me know about that, guys. And then last thing is I picked up two stamp sets that I really wanted. These are by Sunny Studio. This one is so cute with the little um, like town square kind of things. We have the bakery, the cafe, and the boutique. There's a little scooter and a little car, table and chairs. I love the puppy and the street light. And then, of course, there are different sayings. And this is City Streets. That's what that one's called. And then last but not least, I had to pick up this one with all the little mermaids. I thought they were super adorable. This is called Magical Mermaids. And you can see it has different sayings there, but I just loved the mermaids. That's what I purchased it for. I thought they would look so cute in my journal or my planner. Okay, so that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this haul. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any questions, let me know down below in the comments. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, guys.